Hi, my name is Amy. I'm a wife, a mummy, a dog owner, and I used to be a paramedic. I worked for one of the busiest ambulance services in the world for just over 10 years. I did that until we moved to Australia in October 2015. I returned to work when my daughter was nine months old and I was more than happy to do so. My husband and I alternated our shifts, so one would be at work and one would be at home looking after her, and this worked initially. We then realised that we had very little time together and very little family time. To add to that, I'd be out the house for 15 hours a day, come home, do the housework, the shopping, the cleaning, play with my little girl, and I was getting absolutely exhausted. Furthermore, I absolutely started to hate my job. The role had changed, it was no longer what I wanted to do, and I was just starting to not enjoy going into work anymore. But I knew we'd be moving to Australia fairly soon, so I decided I would stick it out. A friend of a friend, however, sent me a message. It was the day before my 30th birthday. Uh, my husband had taken me to Paris to celebrate. We were on a boat on the River Seine, and I was contemplating life. I read the message and I thought, oh, I'll get back to her when we get back. It took me a couple of weeks of thinking and deciding, but I messaged her saying, no, thank you. I knew we'd be moving and I didn't want to start a business with her that I couldn't carry on. And I wasn't actually sure that working for home, from home was for me. She persisted, however, and she messaged me again saying that I could do the business however I wanted to do it, incorporate my little girl, work around her or work with her. Not only that, the business was global and I could take it to Australia with me. My ears pricked up at this, so I decided to take a further look at the business itself. We had a Skype meeting because we weren't close to each other and she showed me the presentation. I instantly saw the potential that the business had to offer. Two months to the day that she messaged me, on the 27th of December 2014, I registered for the business. In three months, I reached my first promotion and I was super excited and I've continued to build a business ever since. I'm now living in Australia, I haven't returned to work and I'm loving living life. Now if this sounds like it could be something for you, then get in contact with whoever sent you the message or whoever added you to the Facebook group and hopefully we will see you within the Forever team shortly. In the meantime, best wishes to you.